Hey you guys, it's Peter, and welcome to my channel, Peter. Boom, 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 boom. Bam, 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 bam. Review stuff, and I am back for another review. This is my crumble cookies review for the week. And I just have to tell you, there is like no place in this parking lot to do a review. Every place that I am, the sun is either in my face and it completely like takes me out or um, it is like too dark and whatever. And I have to tell you, there's a person literally sitting two feet away from me in this car. And I'm like, this is the only parking spot in the entire lot for me to even do a review where you guys can kind of see me a little bit. I don't even know, like if I hold up the box, will you guys even be able to see the box? Yeah. So I care more about you guys being able to see the cookies than me. So even though I'm still kind of like in the shadows a little bit, we're gonna make it work this week. But anyway, anyway, let's get into today's review of crumble cookies. I'm really, really excited. There's a pumpkin pie cookie that looks like a pumpkin pie, obviously. I'm super excited about that. Um, and there's also a cranberry, an orange spray cranberry cookie that I have heard is really, really good. So I'm excited about trying that one as well. So let's just get into this. Now I have to tell you, I just went and ate lunch and I had, um, I went to one of my favorite places ever that's called um, Ruth's Cafe. It's literally on the same strip mall. And I had Grandma's, it's G-R-A-M-M-A-S, <laughs> Secret Grilled Cheese Sandwich, which is basically Velveeta on challah bread. And then I had a bowl of tomato basil soup. I also had a lefsa, if you guys don't know what that is. It's like this crepe wrapped kind of thing and then it has cinnamon inside of it and then you put butter and syrup on top of it. So, Needless to say, I'm not very hungry right now to be doing a crumble cookie review, but I'm going to. So here are the cookies for the week. Let me show them to you and we'll get a little thumbnail. Oh my God, and we'll get a little thumbnail going on. I'm gonna have to figure out where to do reviews when like the lighting is so bad like this. Okay, here we go, you ready? I don't even can see my face in the thumbnail. Do you guys, it is so dark. Should I move? I feel like there's just no, the problem is there's nowhere to move to. Like if I was sitting sideways or something, I could probably manipulate the sun a little bit. Let me see if I move a little bit, if I can get better lighting. There's just like, there's nowhere good to go in this parking lot. So, and uh, do you see like, do you guys see what's going on here? <laughs> I was parked over there and it was too dark and then I was parked over there and it was too light. Like it completely like just drowned me in sunlight. So <laughs> drowned me in sunlight? I was drowning in sunlight. This wouldn't be too bad, but unfortunately there's no places for me to park over here. Maybe I'll go in here and see. <laughs> well, I can't find a good place. Just let me find a good place to park to do this review. Oh my gosh. Okay, now I know when I park over here, it's gonna be complete like darkness and you guys aren't gonna, see, you can't even see me in this light at all, right? So. <laughs> you guys, I wouldn't do this during the video, but I have like, Okay, now maybe if I park over here in this one space, maybe this will be the light. But then the light's behind me, so it's still not going to be great. Okay, well, we're just going to do this. <laughs> Did you guys enjoy that, me searching for the light? Blinded by the light. Oh, this is just as bad as before, isn't it? Oh, well. Oh, well. Maybe it's a little bit better. Is this a little bit better? I can't tell. I almost kind of wonder if it's like this, it's not the settings on my camera, I know that. Okay, so it doesn't matter. Let's get into this video. Here, let's do another thumbnail. So the cookies for the week. Let's get into what the cookies are. I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm just gonna uh, go through these. Here, I'm not even gonna read about what they are this time. This is a salted caramel cookie, okay? This is the Ocean Spray Cranberry Cookie. This is molasses something. I'll look it up. And this is the pumpkin pie here on the end. So let me read to you really quickly what the titles of the cookies are. Um, hold on just a second. Where is my crumble cookie app? Okay. Crumble cookie app. Here we go. The cookies for this week are salted caramel cheesecake. And that's the one that looks like that. Okay. And then you have your maple, so this is the one I'm really excited about, maple cinnamon roll. Okay, can't wait for that. <laughs> and then white chip 
cranberry white chip featuring ocean spray. That's what this one looks like. And then the last one that I got uh, was the pumpkin pie. And it looks like a little mini pumpkin pie. They didn't put that thing on mine. Oh, yes, they did. The little dollop of uh, whipped cream. Okay. So that's the last one. And then they also have milk chocolate chip. And they also have a sugar cookie candy corn. But I've already reviewed that cookie. So I didn't review it again this week. All right. Let's get into these cookies. And I also have a little uh, to-go cup of coffee from <laughs> Ruth's Cafe. All right. The first one that we're going to try is the sal salted caramel cheesecake. I am Ooh. I almost kind of feel like these, you guys, first of all, the maple literally smells like maple syrup is filled in this car, it, filled in this car, it, which it is. It smells so good. So let's try, actually, let's try the maple one first. Here is the maple cookie. This is the maple cookie. What is the, uh, the whole title of the cookie? <laughs> the title of the cookie, like it's the title of a book. The whole title of the cookie <laughs> is... Maple, okay, maple cinnamon roll. So this is what it looks like. It kind of reminds me of those cookies that I love at Christmas time that look like this on the outside and then they have like a Hershey kiss in the middle of it. Oh my God, I love those so much. Okay, what are those called? Do you know? Let me know in the comment section below. Well, it tastes like a sugar cookie with maple frosting on it. A vanilla sugar cookie stuffed with a buttery cinnamon roll filling. I didn't taste that. And topped with a smooth maple glaze. I didn't taste any cinnamon filling in it. Oh, I see it now. Okay. I don't know if you can see it, but it's got like cinnamon in there. That's a huge difference. But man, I'm gonna tell you right now, and I don't usually say this about a bunch of anything, okay? But that cookie is almost too rich and sugary for me. Like, that is a lot. Do you know what it's like? To, okay, this is what it tastes like. You know the cinnamon rolls that come frozen when you pop open that can? Have you ever eaten it raw? I know you shouldn't, it's bad for you, but have you ever? I have. <laughs> Almost anything that's bad for you, I've tried at least once. So, <laughs> family friendly. But truth, have you ever bitten into that? That's what that tastes like. Okay, let's try the white, the cranberry white chip, whatever this one is. Okay, let's try this one and see. I'm like, in my head, I'm like... <laughs> Shut up, Siri. Canceled. <laughs> I'm canceled. <laughs> canceled. <laughs> I'm like, for saying this. <laughs> Does she have macadamia nuts? <laughs> Do she? Do she have macadamia nuts in her? Okay, hold on. <laughs> okay. Cranberry white chip featuring ocean spray. No macadamia nuts. This is actually really, really good. One of my favorites so far. Out of the two. Delicious. Okay. My board is so high in this car. Okay. Let's try the next one, which is the salted caramel cheesecake. I feel like I just tried this one. Was this just like last week's too? I don't know. Wouldn't it be funny if it was and I said something completely different? Here's what it looks like. It smells really good. Okay. Now that is super rich, but that is super delicious. Oh my, I don't think I have tried that one, you guys. The cookie is like graham cracker based. Hold on a second. I want to see what it says. A decadent three-layer cookie with a warm graham cracker cookie base, a creamy layer of cheesecake frosting, and topped off with a dreamy caramel and a touch of sea salt. You guys, this cookie is so fantastic. This is really, really good. <laughs> uh, 
I didn't say I was pretty, okay? <laughs> oh my god, that is so delicious. That's my new favorite. But if you like more of a plain cookie, this is, I mean, this isn't even plain. They're all like really rich this week, but okay. Now let's try the pumpkin pie one. Since a little, <laughs> what if I brought, my cousin Caroline said that it was my job to bring the dessert of which I brought the pie, I'm bringing the pie cake in. Have you guys seen this seven layer dessert? But what if I just brought this little pumpkin? I said, here, I brought pumpkin pie for you. <laughs> Look how delicious that looks, so. Okay, you ready? Let's go. That, it tastes just like a piece of pumpkin pie. It almost doesn't even taste like a cookie. It tastes like pumpkin pie, like the filling in the pumpkin pie, on like the pie crust thing. What is this person doing, seriously? Look at this, like I'm making a video, watch. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? And you already, you just took all of my sunlight. I can't with these people, <laughs> anyway. Um, it's good. It's not as good as I thought it would be. Like, I was more excited about the pumpkin pie than the pumpkin pie ended up being. It's still really, really good. Um, I mean, you guys, first of all, to turn a pumpkin, can we just talk about how fantastic this is? To turn a pumpkin, an actual piece of, like, pumpkin pie, like a real pumpkin pie into a cookie, like, that is so cool, isn't it? It would be kind of cool for, like, Thanksgiving or Christmas, you know, like, if you got one of these each for each person to have as like their dessert. I, wouldn't that be such a cute idea? Okay, my favorite is the salted caramel cheesecake. It is so good. My close second, you guys, I'm telling you right now, this white chocolate, cranberry white chocolate is really, really good. And if you like white chocolate, which I do, I do, I love white chocolate chip cookies. This is kind of like a fresh spin on it. So this is delicious as well. The maple cookie, not my favorite because it is so rich. But if you really, really like super rich cookies, you'll like that one. And that is my review for the week. And somebody's calling me. So anyway, let me know what you think in the comment section below. And have you tried your cookies for the week? And I love you guys. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.